Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be doing a September favorites video. I have a few products that are new this month or products that I've really been reaching for this month. So if you'd like to see which products were my favorite during September, then please keep watching. First, can you guys believe that we are all the way through September already? I feel like I just did a favorites video saying that it was the end of September and I'm like, oh my God, we're not even there yet. And all of a sudden we're here. So the first couple products I'm going to talk about are products I received in my Boxylux box. The first product that I absolutely love, like instant favorite, is this Park Ave Princess palette. I think that the colors in here are perfect for my warm skin tone. I think that this shade right here is so nice to bronze up the skin. The two lighter shades are really nice under the eyes. And then the two matte shades are definitely great for contouring. Again, like I said, I am pretty warm tone, so sometimes the cool tone contours can kind of look muddy on my skin. So that's why I've just really been loving this palette. And I am so excited that I got it in my Boxy Lux because I don't know if I actually would have tried it or not. I wanted to try it, but it is a little on the pricier side. I think it's about $45, $42. I do suggest this palette if you're in the market for a good high-end contour kit. The next product I received in the Boxy Lux box is this Grande Lips Hydra Plump Liquid Lipstick in Rebel Raisin. I think that this is such a nice product. I felt like it was a very comfortable matte. It did dry down, but and it did transfer a little bit, but I thought that it was very comfortable. It did have a slight plumping effect, more like a cooling than like a stinging effect. And I think that the color is just perfect for a fall look. The last product I received in the Boxy Lux that made it to my favorites for this month is the Pretty Vulgar Nightingale palette. When I first saw this palette, I didn't know if I was going to really like it. As I've said, I am warm tone and these are very cool toned colors, minus this one, and so I wasn't sure if I was really going to like this, but the look that I achieved with this palette was so gorgeous. I highly suggest this palette if you do not have it or if you do have it and you're not sure if you're going to like it because you're a warm tone girl, I really think you should try it. Just try it out. I think you'll really like it. The next couple products are highlighters. I wanted to throw in this Jeffree Star Liquid Frost Highlighter. I think this is so pretty, so sparkly, great formula. I don't feel like it takes off my makeup if I do it on top of my powders. I love it for all over the body. I think it gives such a nice shimmer and I really do suggest these. The next product is also a Jeffree Star product. This is the Jeffree Star Skin Frost in Sarcophagus, and I love this color. I think it is the perfect gold for my skin tone. I think it is, it doesn't give kind of like that dark cast on your skin if you're more fair. Um, it does have, you know, like a silvery base to it, so I think that's really nice. It's not like too gold. Sometimes they can be too gold. So I think this is just such a nice highlighter. It's very natural, but you can build it up. Well worth the money. The next item I bought was limited edition, but they just released these again, so I wanted to throw it into my favorites video. It is the Desi Katie collaboration with Dose of Colors, and this is the Fuego highlighter. I just can't get enough of this highlighter. I think that it has the prettiest, like, gold shimmer. It can be a little dark, but I think that uh, if you use like a lighter hand that you won't really see like any sort of cast. 
and I really think that the formula on this is nice. It doesn't accentuate pores. You can build it up. It doesn't make your skin look textured or anything like that. So um, I believe they are releasing these in Ulta. So I just wanted to throw this in there. This is one of my favorite highlighters of all time. I did grab another one on the relaunch so that I don't feel like I have to only use this on special occasions. So I definitely suggest this highlighter. The next item is a foundation and it is the L'Oreal True Match Foundation. This is the shade Nude Beige W3. When I am normal tan, like not winter white, but maybe like summer tan, not like Rocky Point tan, but like summer tan, this is the perfect shade. It blends so nicely into this skin. It basically melts in. It has great coverage. It's not super matte, but it's not super dewy, like a satin finish, I would say. Very natural finish. And if you have not tried the L'Oreal True Match Foundation, I highly suggest this foundation. The last item that I have is a liquid lipstick, and it is the Palladio Casey Holmes Liquid Lipstick in Rescue. And I just think that this is the prettiest color for fall. It does um, kind of have like a more browner tint than the color I'm wearing right now. It does kind of go on a bit more brown. It's like a brownie nude. The formula on these is so nice. It's extremely comfortable. It's not drying. Um, the applicator is really nice. It's kind of more rounded at the top and it holds like a nice amount of product. Um, I think that they are very comfortable. They don't transfer. These are just such great lippies. She has three different shades. I think I even featured the Georgia one in my last favorites video, but I think this one is just so good for fall. And I also use her uh, Obsessed color in my last video, the matte brown video, so I highly, highly suggest picking up some of these liquid lipsticks. And I believe you might be able to find them at Sally's. Definitely online at Sally's. Well, that's it for my monthly favorites. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. If you want to be notified when I upload a video, go ahead and hit the little bell next to the subscribe button so that you know when I upload a new video. I do upload every Tuesday, Thursdays, and Saturdays, so definitely keep an eye out for new videos on those days. And I hope you guys have a great day or night wherever you are. Toddy buys.